What was it you wanted to know? I've forgotten. That's what annoys me. Ah, yes, now I remember. Well? We're not lying. I don't hear a word you're saying. I'm asking you if we're tied. Tied? Tired. Now, how do you mean? Tired. Down. But to whom? By whom? To your man. To Gado. Tied to Gado? What a question. <laughs> no question about it. <laughs> For the moment. His name is Gado? I think so. Ah, yes. Funny. The more you eat, the worse it gets. With me, it's just the opposite. In other words? I get used to the muck as I go along. Is that the opposite? Question of temperament. Of character. Nothing you can do about it. No use struggling. One is what is one what is. No use wriggling. The essential doesn't change. Nothing to be done. like to finish it. Be careful. He's wicked. We're strangers. Is that him? Who? Um, Gardo. Yes. I present myself. Pazzo. Not at all. He said Gardo. Not at all. You're not Mr. Gardo, sir? I am Pazzo. Does that name mean nothing to you? I say, does that name mean nothing to you? What's hot so? What's hot so? What's hot so? Ah, hot so. Uh, let me see. Pot so. Is that pot so or bot so? Pot so. Uh, no. Uh, no, I'm afraid I know I don't see. I that. once knew a family called Gotso. The mother had the clap. <laughs> oh, we're not from these parts, sir. You are human beings, nonetheless as far as one can see, of the same species as myself, of the same species as Pato, made in God's image. Yet you see, who is God done? Godo. You took me for Godo? Oh, no, sir. <laughs> Not for an instant, sir. Who is he? Well, he's kind of an acquaintance. Nothing of the sort. We hardly know him. True, we don't know him very well, but all the same. But personally, I wouldn't even know him if I saw him. You took me for him. Well, um, that's to say, you understand the dusk, the strain, waiting. I confess, I imagine for a second. Waiting? So, you were waiting for well, us you see, here on my land. We didn't intend any harm. We meant well. The road is free to all. That's how we looked at it. It's a disgrace! But there you are. Nothing we can do about it. Let's say no more about it. Every time he drops, he falls asleep. Up, home, back. Stop. Turn. Gentlemen, I'm happy to have met you. Yes, yes. Sincerely happy. Closer. Yes, the road seems long when one journeys all alone for, yes, six hours, that's right, six hours on end, never a soul in sight.
Touch of autumn in the air this evening. Ha! Yes, gentlemen, I cannot go for long without the society of my likes. Even when the likeness is an imperfect one. with your permission. I propose to dally with you a moment before I venture any further. Basket! <clears throat> Fresh air stimulates the jaded appetite. <laughs> Basket! What ails him? He looks tired. Why doesn't he put down his bags? How do I know? Oh, careful! Say something to him. Look! What? His neck. Oh, my son! A running sore. It's the rope. It's the rubbing. It's inevitable. It's the knot. It's the chafing. He's not bad looking. Would you say so? A trifle effeminate. Look at the slobber. It's inevitable. Look at the slaver. Perhaps he's a halfwit. <laughs> a cretin. Looks like a goiter. It's not certain. He's panting. It's inevitable. And his eyes. What about them? Goggling out of his head. Looks at his last gasp to me. <laughs> it's not certain. Ask him a question. Would that be a good thing? What do we risk? Mr. Louder. Mr. Leave him in peace! Can't you see he wants to rest? Basket! Basket! That's better. Please, sir. What is it, my good man? Uh, you finished with the, uh... You don't need the bones, sir. You couldn't have waited. No, no, he does well to ask. Do I need the bones? No. Personally, I don't need them anymore. But, but in theory, the bones go to the carrier. He's therefore the one to ask. But go on, go on, ask him. Don't be afraid. He'll tell you. Mister. Excuse me, mister. You're being spoken to, pig. Reply. 